Welcome back to Six Figs. I'm Kyle, and we're going to be talking about the price of ICP and where it could possibly be going next. You can see on Crypto Bubbles, the entire markets are green, and ICP is up 7.3%, which is great. Now, I've been kind of out of the game trading ICP the last few days myself simply because there was a rising wedge that was forming folks now this is an interesting scenario because the bull stepped down and or the bull stepped up and broke down the bears plans to strip the price of icp so what exactly did happen well price came up we had that very nice bull pennant and this thing kind of flagged out a little bit and then we came back and tested the upper trend line of this rising wedge, and then price took off. So this is an interesting scenario because now price is at $4.25. There is right now a little bit of Elliott Wave theory to the upside. So I am looking for somewhat of a little bit of a retracement going forward. Doesn't mean that it's going to happen, but I am looking for something of this nature and whenever we start to see patterns that have kind of already formed a shoulder in half of a head is that we need to watch out for a couple things we need to watch out for a head and shoulders pattern that could drop the price right back into this rising wedge uh, but this is the one hour chart so i mean i'm not too worried about it I mean, this is such a small time frame here. I don't think we're going to see anything too dramatic, but that is something to kind of keep your eye on. Let's look at ICP on the uh, the weekly chart, folks. You can kind of see that right now price is about to start taking off, hopefully. We have the RSI coming up here on the simple moving average. And I do think that once these things do cross, that we should see some bullish momentum. Here is another example of when they crossed right here. Price just kind of kicked up a little. So right now, what we have going is almost like this weird harmonic pattern that happened. But now on the weekly chart, there is almost like a bear pennant or bear flag whatever you want to call it that is setting up right here but i do think that price is too far away from this ichimoku cloud and i think that this could just simply be an abc corrective wave i am hoping at this point that we can see price come back up to retest this 50 moving average this purple line at about five dollars and forty cents now on the weekly this would be huge because we probably wouldn't make it up to these levels for another week or two, maybe into the second week of July, just a guess. But what's interesting about this is that we have got some clearance starting from like mid August to start pumping into this Ichimoku cloud. And this is going to do uh, wonders for internet computer because it's never been above the Ichimoku cloud in its entire existence on the weekly chart. And once you start getting above the Ichimoku cloud on the weekly chart, let's just look at Bitcoin. Here's a weekly chart. Once you get above that Ichimoku cloud, boy, oh boy, guess what? It is game on. Here is another example. So I am thinking that if we can kind of work our way through the Ichimoku cloud, and, and get price up there, man, we could really see this thing start sailing. I don't think it's going to happen or start to possibly happen or even have the potential to happen until August. And a lot of things have to go right until August. <coughs> oh my gosh, I had a cough there. So this is kind of exciting. Now let's just take a peek at this on the uh, daily. So we're looking at this on the daily. You know, I, I do think that this $5 cent might be a nice price target for now, but uh, right now price is targeting this thinner part of the Ichimoku cloud, and we're going to have to get through this 50 moving average. And my guess it'll happen right around this $4.63 level. Let's just throw up a little fib here to see if we can get 
maybe any guesstimates, you know, maybe $4.25, somewhere in that neighborhood. Uh, but with this 50 moving average, you know, $4.75, we're going to need to see price really rip through that. And I'm hoping that we get some sort of Elliott Wave theory, you know, like this to the upside. And we can really break uh, into that $5.50, $6 range by August. It's going to be very very important folks so for right now uh you can look for a little bit of a resistance at about uh four dollars in you know maybe 30 cents to four dollars in 45 cents as the four hour chart as price tries to move past uh this 200 moving average but really i think that the price of icp is looking great folks and folks let me tell you how you could win 50 icp just by simply joining my trading group let's get it want a chance to win 50 icp that is right folks join the trade tank join the trade tank there is no participation there is no purchase necessary all you got to do is join by clicking the link in the description or the pinned comment and the trade tank is a community folks dedicated to trading the markets doesn't matter if it's forex doesn't matter if it's futures doesn't matter folks if it's options or crypto trading we want you in the trade tank and if you don't have an internet identity because the trade tank is built upon Definity's internet computer you could go ahead and create one and that will allow you to seamlessly navigate through the ICP ecosystem you might as well check it out while you're there so trade tank folks that's where you want to be all you got to do is enter for a chance to win the grand prize of 50 icp which we will be giving away once the trade tank hits 500 members so i love you all we'll see you in the trade tank